winning. The University of Tennessee head football coach Philip Fulmer has few peers when it comes to winning. In the 1990s, UT was one of four programs that had over 100 wins. Coach Fulmer is among the leaders in the nation with winning percentage among active coaches. In 1998, Coach Fulmer led his team to a perfect 13-0 record and captured the national championship and Coach of the Year honors. Tonight, tonight you represented the state of Tennessee and the men that have worn that orange shirt. It's taken 47 years to get it back in Knoxville, Tennessee, but tonight you got the national championship. Hip, hip, hooray! Hip, hip, hooray! Coach Philip Fulmer presents to many organizations the essence of work ethic, battling through obstacles and success. Through his program, The X's and O's of Success, Coach Fulmer guides organizations through the fundamental principles of success that have not only been a personal guide, but the benchmark for his staff and team. It's important that I create a chain of command in the system. I learned a tough lesson that way my first couple of years. I'm working to 3 in the morning, getting back up at 6.30. My wife thought I had absolutely lost my mind trying to see that things were going as I wanted them to go. Made a number of staff changes, getting things, because we were preparing for that 1998 season. It's important that I create a chain of command throughout the system with my coaches and support groups that each person is delegated responsibility and accountability, and they know how to communicate that to their people but also back to me because I can't do it all. Delegate and hold accountable, my coordinators, department heads, whoever they might be. It's important that we are sharing the same message with the players, that they are sharing the same message with the players that I'm sharing with them in the team meeting or in individual meetings that I might have with a player because if the support people, the people in the weight room, the people in the training room, the people in the academic support system, if they're saying different things, then we're sending the wrong messages and different messages to those players. As a leader, I must provide decisions on tough issues, on adverse situations, on direction of the pro program. Creativity, I want to maximize our strengths, minimize our weaknesses, work ethic. I will not be outworked by my assistant coaches or by the the competition. Elimination of waste. You know what the biggest waste of all is? Is an opportunity. Certainly you can waste money, you can waste time, but the biggest waste of all is the waste of opportunity. 